Intellian Aptus mobile app is available as a free download from the Apple iStore. Once the app is installed and launched, it comes up with the standard home screen. On the home screen, it is possible using the menu key at the top right to select the antenna that we wish to log into using the login name and password, along with the IP address of the antenna, either connecting over the internet or directly to a antenna ACU. We enter the password for the antenna and log in. This connects the Aptus mobile app directly to the antenna and allows us then to receive information and display it on the main home screen. The Aptus mobile home screen shows the azimuth and elevation on a graphic display of the antenna that we are connected to. We also have more information on the right hand side of the screen that allows us to get more detailed information on the actual antenna that we have been connected to. To make any changes to the antenna, we have to enter the setup mode using the menu to the right. This switches the Aptus app from being a pure monitoring application to a monitoring and control application and allows us to open the window to the right, giving us access to more advanced menu functions. The first menu option allows us to select a blockage zone. We can select multiple zones, adjust them, range and azimuth, as well as elevation. It's very easy just to select the zone or actually go in and edit it in detail, adding a new zone and then selecting it using the check mark. Once it is set, the graphic will indicate the areas of blockage. Once the blockage zones have been set, hitting the restart button will reinitialize the antenna. It will go through its initialization stage and then switch into tracking of the satellite with the new blockage zones installed into the system. Selecting the menu, we can call up the heading information. This allows us to adjust the heading source, allows us to fine tune the heading, making any small corrections, as well as set the bow offset. Here you can see the main menu screen for adjusting the heading. Using the load satellite menu option, we can go into the system and load the satellite data from the ACU to the antenna, as well as interrogate the antenna to see which satellites it's watching. It is also possible using this menu to select a new satellite to point the antenna towards. Very simply scroll down the list, select the antenna that we wish to use and hit the load satellite button. Selecting the new satellite allows the antenna to repoint and target the new satellite. You can see that uh, on the pictogram and in the satellite information up on the right hand section of the screen. The antenna is now in the initialize phase where it's conducting its search. It's now tracking and locked on to the new Galaxy 19 satellite that we have selected. And once all the signals have been received, the signal level on the upper part of the screen indicates the good lock. For fine tuning, occasionally manual search is required. And this screen allows us to go in and adjust the steps and then adjust the elevation and azimuth of the antenna by small, in this case, five degree increments also within this screen, it's possible to set the pole sensor calibration, as well as fine tune the polarization sensor angle.
The Aptus mobile app allows us to perform full diagnostic tests on the antenna. This diagnostic test allows us to select different tests to be performed, or we can select the complete test cycle. Once each test is selected, then hitting the diagnostic key will actually allow the whole system to perform a diagnostic test. Once the test is complete, a log will be printed out. The Aptus mobile app also has a very handy debug feature. This allows us to record all the debug messages between the ACU and the antenna. We can save these to a file and then actually forward that file to product support for further investigation. Using the backup or restore function allows us to take a backup from the antenna, store that both to the ACU and internally within the iPad. We can also then save that to an external file source or email it. It will also allow us to then use that same file to restore the antenna back to a known working state. The file manager menu is a very useful feature. This allows us to manage the library, the backup logs, the restore logs, as well as all the data. We can actually view the files, forward them to an email address, or actually save them to an external source. At any time while using the Aptus app, we can hit the upper left home button. This will bring us back to the main page. There's also a product support page that gives you access to the email and phone number and contact information for all of the different Intellian technical support centers around the world. From the home screen, it's very easy to log out of the session and close the Aptus mobile app. The Aptus mobile app is available at the Apple iTunes Store as a free download.